Hi, I'm Jennifer Bassett, and I'm the founder and executive director of Hands for Hope, Youth Making a Difference. Eight years ago, in 2008, I was inspired by my own two boys to start a youth-driven service program with education at its core. I wanted my sons to grow up to be compassionate individuals who look beyond themselves and seek to improve the world around them. And I wanted them to understand how much power they have to make a difference, no matter what their age, as well as the joy they could find in serving others. A meaningful experience that I had with Hands for Hope was when I went to the homeless outreach and we fed a child there and he was really thankful for the food that we were giving him. And it made me feel good that I was able to help him out. And it was really surprising that when I first did the homeless outreach, how many people there were on the streets and how many children I was able to help out. As, as a middle school principal, uh, one of the hardest things to teach middle school students is empathy. And uh, programs like Hands for Hope uh, allow our students to see uh, what other people are going through. And then through that, they, they develop empathy for the people in their community who are maybe struggling or going through a hard time. Uh, but not only does it teach them empathy, it empowers them to make a difference and do something positive in their community. Today, Hands for Hope has over a thousand active youth in our programs, and we are growing. Our youth contribute thousands of volunteer hours a year and help with over 200 outreaches annually to build and strengthen local charities. Most importantly, they reach out to community leaders. Then they plan and implement their own original projects to fill unmet needs throughout El Dorado and Sacramento counties. Hands for Hope has programs at 14 schools in four of our local school districts. We partner with over 50 human service agencies, including Twin Lakes Food Bank, Mercy Housing, Hope House, New Morning Youth and Family Services, and the El Dorado County Senior Center, just to name a few. Hi, I'm an adult volunteer with Hands for Hope, and I'm also a recipient of some of their outreach programs through our local charities. As a single mom with two children who are entering junior high and high school, I really worry about them getting opportunities to develop uh, the kind of employable life skills and leadership skills that they're going to need in order to succeed outside of the classroom. To me, one of the most important things that Hands for Hope has to offer our community is that it offers a road for students from all backgrounds to define themselves, not by their circumstances, which may be good or bad, but by their own talents and their abilities and their potential to make a difference out there in the world around them. I really hope that local businesses and organizations will continue to step up to the plate and help the efforts of our youth at Hands for Hope. I was the kind of person who used to be afraid to speak up in class and I'd be hesitant to just state my opinion in front of a group of people. But Hands for Hope changed that for me. So freshman year I decided to join the Hands for Hope club at my school. By being in the club I realized that I'm really passionate about helping others. When I came back home for summer I chose to come back and volunteer with Hands for Hope because I wanted to reestablish that sense of community I had here. And so coming back here and being able to make a difference and being able to reconnect with those other people that I helped out before, that was really touching. After being accepted to college for mechanical engineering, I had to run two different engineering groups. The first group uh, I took a leadership role in was a hovercraft course group where we had to create a hovercraft and then have it navigate a course um, autonomously. And uh, I really feel like a lot of the skills that I learned through Hands for Hope helped me lead that group and keep them on track. And the second group um, was a robotics competition group for one of my mechanical engineering classes, uh, which I also took a leadership role in, which really just goes to show that Hands for Hope's skills that they teach you leadership-wise will not just benefit you in the organization and your high school clubs, but they will benefit you throughout your life. I invite you to join with us in empowering the youth in our area. Your contributions and support allow us to extend our ability to empower the next generation through serving those in their community and give local students from all backgrounds opportunities to experience their power and their potential to make positive, lasting change for themselves and others.